security is tight. Around the venue of what has been described as a critical meeting. So here is Brigadier Kalitai. The Independent National Electoral Commission makes good its promise to hold a stakeholders meeting ahead of the resumption of the electoral processes in River State. The incumbent governor of the state and the PDP governorship candidate, the governorship candidate of the AAC, other party candidates and leaders are also seated as the INEC sets the agenda. The main objectives of this meeting is to brief you on the schedule of activities and timelines set by the Commission for the conclusion of the Governorship and State House of Assembly elections and to solicit for your maximum cooperation towards the success of this exercise. It is also to generate discussions among the stakeholders with a view to achieving transparent, peaceful and violence-free conclusions of the elections within the timeline set by the Commission. It is my strong belief that at the end of this stakeholders meeting, the subsequent electoral activities as outlined in the timelines issued by the Commission for the conclusion of the suspended elections in the state will be carried out as stipulated. And time for the main business as the stakeholders and their views. All we want must be results that will emanate from unit by unit. Why is it that the Commission, after it has gotten all these things, will say that they cannot release the seventy local government they have and the rest that they want to do supplementary elections? Tempers, however, flare up when one candidate makes what some see as unsuitable remarks. Is it that you are promoting violence? Are promoting lawlessness. Excuse me, can you please be respectful of each other? And the governor weighs in on the issue of electoral violence. The only way you can have a peaceful election is when the security agencies refuse to interfere or manipulate any process. <laughs> As a stakeholders meeting comes to an end, many view it as a big step towards the actual conclusion of the suspended electoral processes in the state. But the big one that most people may be keeping an eye on is the actual process of collation and declaration of results. A process people are keeping hope alive will be peaceful. Emmanuel Ereyi, Channels Television News.